Good morning. Good afternoon. Good evening. This creature's just uh, gonna hang out today and kind of show you some artwork that I've been playing around with on AI. I don't know if you've heard of Mid Journey yet. Let's do this. Let's start uh, do some jams real quick. There we go. Do some lo-fi station. Uh, this would be an app that I use that's Pretzel Rocks with uh, OBS. It's free, or you can pay monthly for fourteen ninety nine. But yeah, let's listen to Lo-Fi Station. But yeah, I've been playing around with a um, a Mid Journey. Let me get out of here. I don't know if you've heard of it, but what it is is it's a beta that's in Discord, and you can sign up for it. Uh, when you first sign up, you get invited to Discord through the through their server, and then you end up having 25 times that you can print out some photos or make photos, not print out photos, I'm sorry, make photos for, with them. And so I played around with it for a little bit, then I ended up going with uh, getting started with them and I joined the beta. Let me minimize this real quick, I'll bring it up. So here I'm in Discord, I'm in Mid Journey. Okay. And then I'm going to pull up there. Once you sign up, you get a applic uh, you get a monthly you pay a monthly subscription with them. And it's $10 for like $230 for unlimited. I do the $30 a month one, I do unlimited. So we have our home feed, which I've been playing around with some art here, as you can see. And then I've been looking at the community and checking out their feeds. And then over here on Discord, you can see my highlights, meaning what's going on in Discord. So somebody was playing around with a, a redhead and some ball caps. This is another person doing some castles, some scenery little alien playing with the color palette is what they were saying on this one so yeah so anyways you got all this fun stuff in here that you can scroll around with it looks like they fine-tune their this is yeah, baseball cap girl 2 let's look at baseball cap girl 1 is that what it's gonna say up here yep same person so they fine-tuned it kind of changed some stuff up here okay so anyways I've been playing around with it. And you probably saw a bunch of different videos out there. I kind of want to just take you down my journey. And so let's go all the way to the top here. Uh, it's going to be a little bit because I've been playing around with it for a while. So I started discovering different things, watching some videos, playing around with um, different descriptions. Look at this one I did, Johnny Depp. It's pretty good. Let's go back up here. Like I said, it'll be... We won't go... I want to go to, like, kind of the top and... All right. So, I joined it. And what I started doing was I started just typing in, like, Dark Studio Jubilee. So, this is kind of what they gave me. You have here, you have... Uh, you can make the videos, uh, the photos better. So you can update them to have better quality. So here's one, two, three, four. So you'll go one, two, three, four. If you want to do a variation of number one, you go variation number one, variation number two, variation number three, variation number four. And so here I did two and three, two and three. And then when I had this one, I ended up getting this variation on three I ended up getting this one here Get a little lower there and so I tried it again with Howl's Moving Castle got these and I really like this one here so I updated number two <coughs> and then I did a variation of number two so this was the variation of number two and here, here was the updated one, the final result. 
And I really enjoyed that one, really liked that one, so I saved it. So I started playing around, I was doing like Spider-Man, wasn't really getting the things I wanted. Let's go back up here real quick, because I want to copy something and show you. Okay, we're going to copy Dark Studio Ghibli. Yeah, so I was playing around Spider-Man, just using a couple different words at the beginning. Then I started getting more detailed. And so like I did this one, a beautiful Viking girl, more detail on there. The bat was doing some Batman. Everything looked really good except for the face. So I think I need to start typing in different descriptions like uh, Robert Pattinson. Started playing with around with the Viking girls. And so what you want to do is you kind of want keywords in here like matted painting. You want to play around with lighting, uh, V-Ray, 12K, Unreal, stuff like that. Really important to play around with those. And when you start typing those in, you'll start getting better results. So like I was doing Mandalorian. Kept playing on with Batman. Was hoping that it would come out better. And a lot of these descriptions, a lot of these words are going to be things you don't think of every day. So I'm going to show you how to do the 8K, 4K, full body, thin, slim. You type in like long, long hair, huge chest if you want a chest. So they understand a lady versus a guy. Keep scrolling down. Let's scroll down to the bottom now. You can see I played with a lot of them. Okay, so this one I just did. I did um, Pixar Style by J. Scott Campbell. He's a Pixar artist. So what I want to do is I'm going to put this Dark Studio Ghibli. We're going to go Pixar Style. Let's go beautiful hair. We'll keep we'll keep all this. Let's keep all this. Copy. And make sure you have commas. Okay, and spaces. And then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna come up here and steal some of my of this at the end. We'll go comma. Okay. Then we'll load this. And so then what if it takes it? Oh, you know what I forgot to do? You gotta go backslash image prompt. Always have to do this. And then you put your description in there and you can do this. And if it likes it, it'll come out and say waiting to start. And then it'll start percentage down here. So while that's loading, so basically what I've been doing is when I joined, here's my artwork that I've been playing around with. Here's the community. So let's say I come across a photo and I'm like, oh wow, this army of beauty. Okay, so I see some of the stuff in here, like a headshot, finely detailed body, finely detailed clothing, excited, bright, cinematic lighting. What I've been doing is just copying this. Like So while this one's loading here and we did the Pixar one, what we'll end up doing is we'll go take the beginning of this. We're going to hit copy. And then we're going to go where I like, let's say, pale skin. We'll copy the rest. And then what would we'll, we'll do that there. Oh, I did it again, guys. I just thought you'd like to hang out with me on my journey, what I've been doing, because I haven't been playing video games. I've been playing around with this. Okay. And so this one's 75%. You can see but that description there was way better than what I did with Dark Studio before. So like when I did Dark Studio all by the, itself, we'll compare them and see what comes up. Oh. <laughs> Man, only with you I've been doing this. I like this song. 
Okay. So they finished this one. And this is kind of what they were giving me. With the description I did. So let's clean up one and let's clean up two. Go up here and we got 93%. This one's almost done. Once it's done, it will drop down here. And so with that description, I got all this really cool different images. All right, let's see what they're giving us on this one. Okay, so since I did Dark Studio here and I did all this description and then I did Dark Studio here with this description versus Dark Studio, I'm just gonna get this here versus these. All right, so this one finished. Kind of see, this one's kind of cool. But yeah, it's all about what you type in different descriptions. So we clean this one up. This is what we ended up getting out of this. And then this one cleaned up a lot. I really like this one. Very detailed. Let's go here. A variation of that. Or if we go... Let's go back to this night. And if we go... And if we go... Let's... Let's see Star Wars. The beginning. Let's see what comes up. Ooh, look at these. So look at the variation on this one. This one's super cool. I like the detail on here. They're actually both really cool. But yeah, so it's just going in here, going into a gallery. There's also other webs sites that you can find this information for these detailed pictures the the way that somebody I was watching on YouTube they were just saying go to the photo you like copy command copy uh, the prompt you know and so I was getting a lot of weird variations and I wasn't really understanding it but if I now take some of the last information on here well, let's look at her Pixar so if like, you decide what you want in here and you just copy it. And we'll go. Oh, I spelled Star Wars wrong. Then we do the Pixar one, but look at this. This are kind of cool. And you can make them look better. So like if I like four a lot and I want to update that one and we'll go two. That's fun. Just going in here and just kind of playing around with the different art styles. And so what I've been doing, let me show you this. been playing around with different people's arts it's like some of my favorites were today bring this guy over so I've been doing this and just getting all these really great neon Star Wars stormtrooper prints butterfly that I did okay let's see what was the other one that I did today? Maybe I haven't saved them yet. I haven't really saved, I haven't saved them. These are all older ones. Okay. So then here was the Pixar, Star Wars, Redhead. It's really cool. So it came from here and then I had a, a twist on it with Star Wars. This one here, added Star Wars. 
Looks like someone painted that. So with these, let's go in here and see what else we can do. Let's uh, look at this one. Let's copy all this. The cool thing about it is, is you're not stealing anything because everything's original on Mid Journey. You're paying for the licensing, so no one could sit there and say you're stealing anything. All they're really doing is, is their the AI is regenerating it for you. So, like I did this with Star Wars. Versus her here, so let's see what we get. I'm going to show you after this one loads if I wanted to just take what they had here. I'm taking this here. I'm going to copy all this description and then watch what we do here. I mean, you can do this if you are want to try regenerating that photo or something like it. Let's do it now and see what happens versus this one. She just came out great. Like, I like this first one a lot. See what this and this, same description, except for we're just at a Star Wars. It's fun to watch them too when they load. I just realized this detail on the neck. It's cool. It looks like an elf warrior in a way. So just by typing this in, what they have here, then I'm going to show you something else once we're done here. So this would be the same, what I, this description here I typed in here does not look anything alike, does it? So then we'll, we'll go down here and what they were doing is they got this image from a parent photo or from an image. So they took it from this image here and put that in there to generate this. So what we did is we copied this and threw it in there. See if it, all right. So to see the difference is they use a photo image And what they probably ended up explore relative related, I meant. Somebody was doing the same thing with these. So play around with this one. Let's see what we can get an image out of this. So we like number one. Let's update number one and let's update number three and see what we get. These are cool. It's amazing what this AI does. Mid journey again, mid journey bot. The only thing is, is you got to really work on the eyes. Like, let's look on this one. Blue eye looks like a little orange eye. On that one. So we can get the same photos. 68%, 50%. They have a fast mode. When you pay $30, you get unlimited and then on the 200 one, if you hit 200, they have a relax mode. It takes longer for you to get them to load. But I mean, these are loading pretty darn quick. Now let's see what we got here. So this versus this. Go disappear here in a second. This one versus this. This will disappear here in a second. 
So see kind of like how the eyes are set. So let's say I want to see if what the variation on the eyes and the nose will make a variation. Let's say we like this one and we want to do upscale to max. We'll see what they give us. Yeah, so us copying whatever they typed in isn't the same thing. So it could be kind of in that category. Maybe more like this bottom one, like the, these top three, but it's not the same thing. Kind of like this one a lot. What is this one? Opal Stormtrooper. That's cool. Okay. He Jackman. That's crazy. All these Hugh Jackman people are doing. Hmm. This one's cool. Like the ears. All right, so this one, we made variations. This one we're upscaling. So now look at the variations. And then if you open up the original, they're really big. You get a little bit more detail out of them. Helps me visually with their faces and everything. And then this one was upscaled from this one. So we had this one originally. And we have this one now. Looks so much better. The eyes got better. And then what you do is you click on yours original and then it'll open up to the web. And you just right click on, right -click on this one and save it. Throw it into your folder, wherever you have it on your computer. Let's try this one. Let's try inverted. I like that. See what we get out of here. Oh, that one's super cool. And when the eyes are closed, they they look a lot more human versus realistic than they do. Um, like an oil painting. Like this one's kind of like an oil painting. This one's Tim Burton. Like they took a real person and made it Tim Burton. Where this took a real person and they painted it. None of that made sense in my head. And then I said it out loud. Look at these. These look super fun. So this one would be Cute Burnett wearing headphones with cat ears. That's why we have the cat ears. All right, so this one finished. This first one's really cool. I actually like all four of them, but now what we're gonna do is let's update number one. And I like the ears disappearing on this one. Translucent, transparent. Which one I like more? Two or four? Let's go four. Okay, so here's this. And then here, this is getting improved. It's at 60%. Alright, then I'm going to kind of mix it up with the ladies in here. And let's go to something a little bit different. I have something in mind. 8650. Oh. We're 
we're gonna go anime. We go back here. We're gonna mix some of this stuff up. Let's go. Haunt it. Well, we already have some of those. That was cool. They're all using the same terms. This looks pretty real. So let's see. Um, yeah, this one looks really good. Let's see. Uh, copy. We're going to go here. We're going to actually go look at this one. We're going to do some tanks. I haven't done anything military yet. So we'll get, okay. So these finally came up. I like that one. Actually, it looks like it was used with crayons. Eyes are super cool. And then we have this one. That one's super cool too. Looks like it has a little Winnie the Pooh and a pumpkin on the shirt. Let's uh, see what Tim Burton and Liz Frank look like when it comes to tanks. gonna move this out of the way real quick I think what's really cool is you can do like wallpapers uh, have fun putting these on the website getting people to look at them oh my goodness look at these those are super cool. We want, we definitely want to update three and have a variation of three. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna do city, Cyberpunk City. Copy this one. We'll, we'll throw neon at the end, see what, Cool colors can come up out of that. Check out this. Oh yeah, look at that. That's cool. I love the pink. Those are super cool. Alright, so we want to do probably update number two as well. So this fine this fine finished. Yeah, see that's something I'd hang on my wall. We're gonna skip that song. That was like a weird staticky sound in it. Okay, let's see. 59. Cyberpunk Cities. I'm I'm really digging this mid-journey, guys. And girls. And everybody's. That was super cool. So we just literally went from where did we start off? Let's play around with a uh, Star Wars picks picks our style. Stormtroopers went into some more picks our style stuff. 
Got into Star Wars now after that. Just going into whatever this these artists are. I have no idea who they are, but co copied over here and did some of that. Played around with those, compared them to the artists on here on the website. Played around with some cute brunette girl wearing headphones. Went into tanks. To Cyberpunk City. Clean this one up. Let's clean this one up, I like. Let's clean up this one. That's super cool. And for the very last time, since we're on here, we'll do one more after those guys render. Let's go Orchard of Spider-Man. See what we have. I like this song too. These Cyberpunk City ones are going to be cool. Once you get more detail into them. Okay, remember you got to upgrade them or you can do variations. Miles Morales. That's cool looking. All right, let's look at this one. Yeah, see, that's super cool. I'd print that out and hang that on my wall. Right next to that one. Yeah, see, uh, I'm going to play with the city one some more. I really like that. Okay, so they finished this one. You kind of get the little bit of Spider-Man on the chest. That's the parent one. So what I was talking about commands and prompts, let's copy the command. Let's throw this in here under images. You kind of see the different things you get. What they do is they have the commands down here. I'll highlight them for you. Those are the, some of the important commands to probably make this a, not really close like this. It's going to take a little while to get here. But let's see what it does. Since it's at 7%, we'll compare this to this. These are cool. I wanted to look at this. That's super cool. This one was cool too. Whoa. That looks really good. Hmm, Fallout turns 25. Celebrate Fallout's birthday this month with in-game giveaways, events, discounts, and more. Explore Fallout games. That's cool. Just got the message. I like that Spider-Man a lot. Okay, so then this one's done, which looks nothing like this. I mean, the the, the and when I say nothing like it, I'm talking about the Spider-Man and the detail colors but you can see that's a starting point for you it's super fun to play around with these things but yeah that's just kind of 30 minutes into showing you mid journey on discord with an unlimited plan how quick it goes um, what you can do 
Uh, I don't think it'll ever stop you on being creative. And so we got to be a little creative in life. So if you want to subscribe, like, follow, whatever you like to do, I appreciate it. I hope you have a great Monday, a great day, and we'll see you soon. Thank you for watching, my friends. Bye.